Are you on the last one yet? No, uh, we gotta we gotta make sure. Well, sort of. As you lose a bolt, <laughs> here. here. I put them with the collection. I put them on the in the V yep. of the welding tr truck. Remember, you can't rotate your camera because the Ferrari sits back there. You can't have anybody seeing the Ferrari. Let's get a better look at this thing. This thing's kind of big, actually. So, would you say it's the front motor out of a great all? It's the front motor out of a great all. So you can see that's still the frame rail from the great all. Now it's set up as a skid. It's got this big old pump on it. Um, yeah. oh, All the controls there. No, I didn't. This is the throttle. Linkage. Okay, so this is idle. Remember, this is idle this way, and then pulling it this way clockwise is going to be full. I'll leave you in charge of that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be clockwise all the way around, bud. So yeah, I like your idea of just rotating this so we can hook everything back uh, on. Yeah, where's the wrench? Right here. Uh, it's a premium spot for this. Where's the vice grips? <laughs> all right, so I just hooked up the electrical system here. We've got going this used place. forklift battery, used SA400 battery, which is very old looking. Where'd you get the bolts? They're on the back of the welding truck. Um, we're missing one vice grip for the uh, optimal. I want, is this thing 12 or 24 volt? Uh, I think it's a 20, well, I think it's 12 volt, but I think it's hooked up. So it's 24, you know, you know. Okay. <laughs> All right, well, there we go. We have every, we got the circular vice grips, flat style, the mini circulars, and then the long nosed ones. That was a good clamp. All right, so that's good. Let's check in over here on Steven on the, uh, oh, yeah, right apart. Mm. Nothing even made a home down in there. Is there a gasket? It doesn't look like there's a gasket. That's a gasket on there. <sighs> gasket. On that. That's what that black stuff is. Good. All right, so now we're going to, oh, we could just oh, yeah, it's do that. All right, so we'll hook those back up, and we should be ready to go. It's calibrated. So Anthony just pulled the dipstick here. It looks a little, it's oil. Yeah, it's oil, but it looks oil. a little watery, maybe. We got some diesel, we got some diesel fuel on the, it smells like diesel fuel, yeah. It does. It smells like an old motor, that's for damn sure. What about coolant? Did we check coolant? It's outside. <laughs> it's winter time, it can't even get hot. <laughs> Oh, yeah, it's cooling down there. It looks kind of green. So as Steven says, it'll fire right off, probably. Yeah, you just totally jinxed everything, buddy. I mean... How long do you think it's been sitting? Uh, three years, maybe. Three years, nothing. maybe. Ain't nothing. So we got to figure out what we're doing with these two giant hydraulic hoses here. If we're going to loop them together. And then... <laughs> I don't think we're going to pull the valve covers off and check the rack. Yeah, make sure you stand right here in line with the spring when you're playing with it. Losers. Yeah. Um, we're just going to trust the rack's not stuck. We did it last time. Yeah. They don't get stuck. They don't get stuck. If it wasn't stuck before, it won't be stuck now. No, it's fine. The power is off, eventually. Yeah, and we got the master off, so we're good. You said you need a pair of vice grips? You got no, we're four? good. Anthony's you got, got four now. Vice grip. Yeah, already sure. All right, so we're almost ready here. So we got Steven demonstrating the. Uh, we're gonna safety this safety blanket. Okay, I'm gonna go like this. Go like this, and then you, Patrick. I'm, this is. You're gonna do this. Okay. Well, yeah. And then you're gonna slam it down on here. Got it. Hold it like this until she shuts off. Got it. And choke it out. Yeah, choke it out. So the last thing we got here is to try and figure out how to hmm. hopefully connect these lines together so they don't shoot hydraulic fluid clean across the farm. Fine. I mean, hopefully this valve's shut, but you know, <laughs> who knows? <laughs> All right, so we got the big old hose going together. Hired a fireman just for this job. Ain't going nowhere. Our battery situation's good, <laughs> not best. Premium. I wouldn't even give it a hobby either. No, I think, I think it'll go. It should be ready, right? Uh, do you yeah. want to 
Like, so that's one. That's, that's how I was sitting to you. Yeah, so, and then this should be over. So that's kind of. So we'll just pull the. Okay. All right. Should be. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear in the video over the exhaust, but the uh, alternator was not spinning, so the belt was just slipping on. <laughs> it's still <laughs> slipping, like. Yeah. Well, good. Yeah. I can't. That's, that's ridiculous. That is absolutely insane. Yeah, that was really easy. That's why these things. I bet you there's no teeth. <laughs> <laughs> at all. Yeah. Okay. Did you turn this? Yes. Oh yeah. And. I mean, it spins, but. Turn. You're not getting any WD-40 in there. <laughs> How about DW? <laughs> That's what Francesco calls it. He calls it DW. That's only brand new, never been used. Um, we'll need an alternator, probably. More activity than sure. in that warehouse. The tool of choice. Oh, oh. And yeah. it ain't going nowhere now. Hell yeah. Oh, it's right on the back, too, yeah. Does it pass all the way through? Today it will. <laughs> Try it. Oh, shit. Anthony, you're here for the perfect day, man. Try it again? Yeah, let me get out from <laughs> on top of Come it. On. We said.
That thing's real happy. Yeah.